What's up guys? So the update is live. Uh, I'm just gonna delete my last video. If you saw it, it's basically the same as this. If you didn't see it, it's basically the same as this. So there's no point. Uh, this one's gonna be better because it's gonna have more information and it's gonna be live. Uh, the double chow weekend. Uh, I'm, we're gonna call it chow weekend, d d double chow day. Ch I, I don't know, but basically it's the luck of the chow effect. But it's actually better because we figured out that the actual luck of the chow effect, which is balanced for being a permanent item that every, you know multiple people can have, uh, 24/7. Um, it's not good for an event. <laughs> it's not. It's not. Certainly not powerful. Um, so it's actually one in two right now. It's super boosted. Um, either it's 50/50 chance to get your your very rare loot uh, double. So I will be doing a stream tomorrow. We're probably gonna have Pond join us at some point. I think I've already talked to him about that. So it should be fun. Um, yeah, let's get into the update. So the main thing uh, that uh, was really a part of this update was quality of life stuff. So there's some a lot of random fixes here and there. Hydra, Drake, Wire, and Bones should be notable. And now the Bone Crusher should work with them. The same as uh, Superior as well. Uh, the Rat Pet is no longer tradable. Sierra's Charms have been updated again. Um, the 500 points. Uh, yeah, like I said in my last video, one of the main reasons why I haven't made the video yet is because I keep changing them. I think now I'm at a point where I'm going to change them or make the video. So <laughs> you should see that soon. The actual big item you want, the Sierra's Blessing, that's uh, Sierra's Brew. Sierra's Brew. Sierra's Brew. That's the item. Uh, that actual item is um, it's slightly more common. When I said slightly more common, people took that uh, to mean way more common. When I when I say slightly, I mean like it could have been. Okay, so it was before it was like one in two hundred fifty six. Maybe like it's not really one in two hundred fifty six, but it's like roughly around that. So that's the number I always use to like give people an example. Um, so instead of being that, it's more like one in two hundred forty. So it's not like crazy better, but it is slightly better. Um, and then you also do have the independent one in 500 roll. Um, so you basically have two chances at it every time you you, you, you pop one. Um, the in-game store has changed as well. You can see that some of the junk stuff is missing and the prices have been adjusted a little bit. Um, still kind of figuring out what I want to do with it. It's one of those things where it's like, it just just existing is always going to be a downside to the game, but cosmetics and like subscriptions and stuff like that. That's just not how we can. We, that's just not the way to take monetization of the server. I think the donations we have is the best way. We just got to keep working at it and making it balanced and making it work with the actual live game. So another thing we're trying to do is get people to vote more. Uh, so the vote shop has been updated a little bit, and then you also have Sierra's Charm in here as well. You can also get the charm from the vote tokens. Um, I'm probably going to do another update to the vote tokens by themselves, and then when I do that, I'm going to make another video showing them off. Um, but yeah, they, they are on there. I think that was the only new thing I added. I might have made some other changes. I don't, I don't really remember. That's not even part of this update. I kind of did it randomly in the middle of uh, last update, I guess. I believe so, yeah, but... Um, the chance of getting a large cash bag from the Outbreak minigame has been drastically increased. And the reason I did that is because now you only get one medium cash bag, but the chance of getting the large cash bag is 1 in 5, where it used to be 1 in 50. So it's 10 times easier to get that. Uh, Twisted Bow... The Twisted Bow now has a boost against Nightmare and Chemical Hydra. You can no longer drop Sliske Shadow. For some reason, people seem to drop it all the time, so I figured I would just make a specific um, <laughs> restriction against dropping it. Uh, top, top voters at the end of the month uh, will receive a prize. Whenever you vote, and if you've never voted, shame on you, but I'll show you what it looks like when you vote. When you vote and it loads, you can see the top voters over here. So, yeah, the five people who are on the top list will get a nice little prize at the end of the month. Uh, as far as up there updates, let's go. Um, the the in-game reward for when you vote seven days in a row has been increased. I think it was five mystery boxes. Now it's 15. Um, I'm still looking into that. I, I think I might improve it even more, but it's 15 at the moment. Um, Inquisitor and all of the other new stuff, the, the just occurs... Not just occur. Um, Dragon Hunter Lance and the Ferocious Gloves and the Inquisitor. All that stuff now has component value. It's pretty good component value. It's all in, uh, Uber components and it's it's high um, set amounts, uh, similar to raid armor. Very comparable. So like for example, the helmet I think is fifty thousand, and then the legs are seventy five, and then the plate is a hundred. Um, now, whenever you're doing, uh, when you're hunt, you're searching for the spear parts while fighting Tuz, you now uh, the, the chance of finding them is, is a lot higher. 
Well, not a lot higher, but higher. <laughs> it's higher. Um, and then the chance of getting the Golden Spears is higher as well. You now have a, a base amount of uh, boss invasion points whenever you smash a bust. So let's just do... So before, you would get anywhere from 1 to 50. And now it's actually 25 to 75. The actual cost is 75, so I upped it to 75. So they're a lot better. It's a lot. You have a lot more chances. Uh, of course, I hit. That should not be possible. Well, that doesn't work. Don't do it. Don't smash busts. Um, I. Oh. <laughs> so. So basically all I did is made it do the randomization twice. It does the randomization of 25 and then it does it 50. So that's actually, um, I'm not going to update the server just for that, but I'm going to remove it from the list so people don't think that it's a thing. And then um, when I have to do the update to remove the chow day, I will add that in. Uh, so, <laughs> oh yeah, we figured that out live. But it, it is, oh, you know what? That means that the, there's, a, there's a donator thing called the invader bundle. And it essentially gives you the exact same effect. But that's broken too, so that kind of sucks. I'm going to have to fix that. Anyways, that's it for the updates. Uh, is there anything left? No, that's, that's pretty much it. Thanks for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed. We do have the, the, the double drops this entire weekend, so come join us. I will be streaming tomorrow, likely around 1 p.m. Pacific Standard Time. So, yeah, see you guys then.